Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a significant stride towards bolstering its artillery capabilities, Thailand's Defense Technology Institute, DTI, has delivered two prototypes of the 105mm light howitzer CS-AH2 to the artillery battalion at the artillery center of the Royal Thai Army. The delivery, announced officially by DTI on April 24, 2024, marks the culmination of a collaborative research and development endeavor between DTI and the Artillery Center, aimed at enhancing artillery training and operational readiness. The genesis of the CS-AH2 project traces back to September 2021 when DTI Thailand secured a contract worth 48 million baht, $1,439,712, with Polytechnologies Incorporated from the People's Republic of China. This collaborative effort, targeted at producing a light cannon tailored for export markets, gained momentum with a Memorandum of Understanding signed in March 2023 between Thai DTI and the Artillery Center. Extensive testing, including firing tests conducted throughout 2023 at Khao Phu Lan Artillery Shooting Range, paved the way for the successful delivery of these advanced prototypes. The design and features of the CS-AH2 prototypes incorporate elements akin to established light cannons such as the BAE Systems M119, L119, and the Nexter LG-1 MK3 towed light cannon. Notably, the CS-AH2 is equipped with a sophisticated digital fire control system and satellite coordinate capabilities, akin to the display systems utilized in the recently serviced Nexter LG-1 MK3 by the Thai military. The M119, renowned for its lightweight and high mobility, is a towed 105mm howitzer used by the United States Army and Marine Corps. With a maximum range of approximately 11,500 meters and versatile firing capabilities, it is prized for its rapid deployment in diverse battlefield scenarios. Similarly, the Nexter LG-1 MK3, employed by several countries including Belgium, Canada, and Thailand, emphasizes compactness and operational flexibility. With a maximum range exceeding 17,000 meters and advanced digital fire control systems, it offers enhanced accuracy and compatibility with modern military communication networks. The introduction of the CS-AH2 comes at a pivotal juncture as Thailand endeavors to replace aging artillery systems, such as the 12M425 rubber-wheeled self-propelled light cannons and 32 locally built towed light artillery M618A2 units. As the Royal Thai Army focuses on modernizing its artillery units, the CS-AH2 emerges as a viable candidate for replacing outdated systems, aligning with Thailand's strategic imperative of enhancing its defense capabilities. In conclusion, the delivery of the CS-AH2 prototypes signifies a significant leap in Thailand's artillery modernization efforts, underlining the nation's commitment to maintaining a robust defense posture amidst evolving security challenges in the region. That's all for now. See you later.